Are you ready for the rainbow line, Mia? Hey guys, we've got the Tokyo belt buckle. Inside the box, you'll find the buckle, the belt, and Shield Russia. So that's what that looks like inside the box. The belt is two gray plastic pieces, and they fit together just kind of like that. This just fits in like that, clicks in. There's a release button here. I think this is especially cool for younger kids, especially kids that can fit into this little tiny belt, or Mia and especially if you live somewhere where train travel is realistic. As you guys know, we live in Angel Grove, California, and we have the tap card. On this side, there's a little slot, and you can take your tap card and slide it in. So now when you go to the tap machine, you can tap it, and you can get through. So if you're out and about for the day, maybe you're going to downtown LA to check out Anime Jungle or something like that, you can wear this. When you go to the tap machines, just take that off and tap it, put it back in. So it kind of holds your ticket ID thingy. But I should warn you that it does fall out kind of easily, so just kind of make sure you don't drop it. It's already been a while since I've been to New York. I heard that they were going to do the tap thing. I don't know if they've done it yet or if they're still doing it, but either way, the Metro card can sit in there. Of course, this you have to swipe, so you would have to take it out, swipe it, put it back in. It's a little bit more of a pain than if you have a tap card. But if New York has done the tap card, then it's the same deal as in LA. I can't decide if I recommend this for older fans or not. I think it's really cool that they've incorporated a Power Rangers thing into everyday real life use. I wish it didn't slide out so easily. And I kind of wish there was something on the back. I don't know, I think they could have kind of done this differently somehow. I'm not really sure what I would suggest they did, but I both really like it and think it could have been better. I would especially recommend this to younger kids who are big fans of Power Rangers and or Tokyo, kind of like roleplay stuff, and preferably who live near trains, because that's where you're going to get the most fun out of it, I think. And then, of course, Bandai knows they have to include one of these, in case you don't just want that, so. Shield Russia. Fits on the arm just like that. It opens, and it's very pretty. I like colorful things. It works like any of the other Russias. Anywhere there's a thingy, you can snap it on. It doesn't really work like that, unless you want to open it a little bit and kind of be a foot. Here he can lean. Sort of. It connects. Either way. And then, in the morpher. Even for adult collectors, if you have a display shelf, you can take the belt off. This could be a perfectly good display shelf piece if you're doing a Tokyo display. Also, on the show, they use this as a phone. There's really nothing on here to indicate that it's a phone, but I guess we could pretend. Let's prank call Mia. Uh, what's her number? Uh, bu -bu -bu. wondering, is your refrigerator running? No. Are you sure? Yeah, pretty sure. Is yours? Well, yes, but... Well, you better go and catch it. <laughs> Mia! Oh. I, I think I got reverse pranked. Mia! All right, 
anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll be back with more good videos. Please subscribe. i call her back. Uh, please like, share, all that good stuff. And good night.